Oh, I think I've, I've the smiley face permanently plastered on this face of mine. And this is going to make you smile now as we get into our Mandela Monday hero. Although autism is well known, few people, I think, truly understand the impact of the condition until they're affected by it in their circle of friends or certainly their family. It's rare that a young person with no personal connection to the condition would devote their time and talent to helping children with autism. But it is precisely why Anna Moshitama is our Mandela Monday hero. autism technician is that we have the expertise and the training and the skills to treat children with autism and to help them overcome their challenges. Teaching children how to function as human beings is very inspiring. Anna Moshitama is a BA psychology graduate who helps children with autism as an autism technician at the Star Academy's Athel Center as well as part of their outreach program in Tembisa. Autism is a social and communicative disorder. So most of our kids come in non-verbal and not very social, so they have um, skill deficits. So then through that they engage in a lot of behavior because it's very frustrating for people not to understand you. So some kids come in non-verbal and they don't speak at all, and some come in verbal but they still need assistance with phrasing things and making sentences, and then some of them are not very social. So we teach them how to become social, so that's how autism looks on a day-to-day -day basis. So an autism technician is someone who actually works with the kids with autism. So at the Star Academy we are both certified autism technicians. So we are trained to manage behaviour and then teach our kids skills, like the differences that, that they have. We teach them skills and we replace their behaviour with appropriate behaviour. This caring young woman also played a role in starting the Tembisa Outreach Project, which raises awareness and offers practical support to families. I help facilitate a Tembisa outreach um, support group with the psychologists at Tembisa Hospital. Mainly we just um, try to do a lot of parent training for the parents whose kids are not in the program because they're not getting any assistance at all since they're not in the program. And then also with the parents that are in the program, they also give out information to the other parents just to help them out. There are a lot of challenges because there's a lack of resources, especially in South Africa. So especially with the outreach project, we, we're struggling with finding space because we have a lot of kids on a waiting list. So I think I'd say that's the biggest challenge, especially with our outreach project, resources, lack of resources. The Star Academy is an academy that provides education programs to children on the autism spectrum. Um, Star Academy works with children from the ages of 17 months to 17 years old. Um, we cater for children across the autism spectrum. The parents in Tembisa have been given the opportunity to send their children to a top um, facility that is providing them with free ABA programs on a daily basis. We feel very committed to the Tembisa community in providing their children with expert education programs and um, they come free of charge. For parents, help from qualified autism technicians is life-changing as they are given resources of information, treatment and emotional support. This project is so important because there are many kids with autism and in the, in the, the community can't handle this child. They, know, they don't know how to, be, to behave with these children because they are so hyper. They can't deal with these hyper children. But now with this Star Academy, is great and other kids want to get in the school also. For me it's amazing to actually help people from my own community because a lot of people tend to forget like when they start working and they start doing things for themselves they actually kind of forget where they come from so doing something from for my community is is amazing because I'm helping out the people that some of them raised me some of them went to church with some of them I get to change their lives on a day-to-day -day basis so that's amazing. With just a little push in the right direction, these children can end up moving mountains and they have loving help from someone like Anna to guide them on their way.